everyone, welcome back to PMI Mountain Gateway. If you're a renter or a landlord, understanding the ins and outs of the lease agreement is crucial. Today we're going to discuss common lease mistakes that both parties often make, and more importantly, how to avoid them. But before we get started, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our valuable content. Let's dive right in. First up, one of the most common mistakes is not reading the lease agreement thoroughly. Many people skim through it or skip reading it altogether, which can lead to a misunderstanding later on. Take the time to carefully go through each section and clarify any doubts you may have with the landlord or property manager. Verbal agreements may seem convenient, but they can be a recipe for disaster. Always get everything in writing. If it's not in the lease agreement, it's not legally binding. This help protects both parties and ensures everyone is on the same page. Ignoring maintenance responsibilities is another common pitfall. Tenants should report issues promptly, and landlords need to address them in a timely manner. Clearly outline maintenance responsibilities in the lease to avoid conflicts down the road. This includes how to report maintenance issues. Skipping the inspection process before moving in is a big no-no. Both tenants and landlords should conduct a thorough walkthrough, documenting the condition of the property and any damage. This helps avoid disputes over the security deposits when it's time to move out. Another mistake is not including all occupants of the lease. If someone is living in the property, they should be listed on the lease agreement. This ensures everyone is accountable and protected by the terms of the lease. Overlooking lease termination and renewal terms is a common oversight. Understanding the notice period required by both parties and be prepared for what happens at the end of the lease term. This prevents surprises and helps with planning for the future. And there you have it, common lease agreement mistakes to avoid. Whether you're a tenant or a landlord, taking the time to understand and clarify the terms of your lease can save you a lot of headaches in the long run. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, and leave any questions or topics you'd like us to cover in the comments below. Until next time, happy renting. Thank you for joining us at PMI Mountain Gateway. If you want more tips on property management, renting, real estate, and investing, be sure to subscribe. See you in the next video.